weather with Damian Lotus. I am tracking picture perfect weather here for your Saturday, but over the next 24 hours, we're going to see that switch to a chance of severe weather and then way down the line after Thanksgiving, possibly a chance of snow. Let's get you ready for the latest here on your early Saturday morning. Some cloud coverage across southwestern parts of the state. Temperature wise right now, we're starting off pretty cold in the 30s, 36 right now along Highway 81 between Kingfisher, Okarchi, El Reno and Chickasha. 38 right now in Oklahoma City. Across the rest of the state, we have a mix of 30s and 40. Some freezing temperatures here to start your early Saturday morning. When you factor in the winds, it feels like the 20s across northwestern parts of the state and the panhandle. So yes, definitely jacket weather this morning. But as we head throughout the rest of the day, I'll be tracking lots of sunshine. High today will make it to the 60s. Light winds, sunny skies, that's my kind of November weather for sure. And across the rest of the state, we'll see a mix of 60s and 70s here for afternoon highs. Looks like we'll tap 71 today in Stillwater. For Oklahoma City, looks like we'll tap 67 here for this afternoon. Same thing for Midwest City, Dell City, 66 this afternoon for both Chickasha and Norman. And as we head into this afternoon, mostly sunny skies, but as we head into the evening hours, some cloud coverage developing off to our west. And as we head into the evening hours, 9 to 10 o'clock, showers and thunderstorms developing off to our west. These thunderstorms are going to slowly start to work their way into the Oklahoma City metro right around midnight. And by 6 a.m. this time tomorrow morning, we will see some scattered showers, even some rums of thunder here to kick off your early Sunday morning. We'll have our crews out to bring you the latest. 9 a.m. we could see some rums of thunder, possibly some thunderstorms storms here across central parts of the state. So that's the timeline for tonight. Storms will begin around 3 a.m. Really start to ramp up at 6 a.m. and then peak around 9 a.m. And lows tonight will be a mix of 40s and 50s. Here's that overall rain chance for tonight. The highest chance of accumulating rainfall will be across northwestern parts of the state. And picking up where we left off by lunchtime, 12 o'clock, that first wave will push its way into northern and northeastern Oklahoma. And then after that, we'll see some spotty showers and thunderstorms during your Sunday afternoon. And if we see any severe threat, it'll be during the afternoon hours pushing into central and eastern Oklahoma. Here's a snap shot around midnight so the storms will persist throughout the day on Sunday and highs because of the cloud coverage because of the rain will only be in the 60s here for your Sunday afternoon. So here's the storm zone. The overall setup for Sunday afternoon pretty much all of central and northern Oklahoma will be under a low threat of severe weather. Any storms that form in this green shaded area will be capable of producing small hail, strong winds and even some heavy to flooding rainfalls we head throughout your Sunday. And then on Monday temperatures will rebound a little bit for southern Oklahoma, but we'll still be in the 50s up to our north. Tuesday, another front sweeps its way across the state. That's going to bring us some much cooler air with cloudy skies and temperatures in the low 50s, but we will rebound. Here's the overall rain projection between now and Monday, primarily Sunday and Monday. We'll see good rain chances here for central and northern Oklahoma, an inch possible here for some parts of the state. And then yes, wind chills. Take a look at this. This is after Thanksgiving, so this is going to be the Sunday after Thanksgiving. That's when it looks like our first real batch of Arctic air will sweep its way across the state, dropping wind chills into the single digits across western Oklahoma and also bringing Yes, next Saturday, next Sunday, next, the weekend after Thanksgiving, bringing a pretty good chance of snow, it looks like, across northwestern parts of the state. For that seven-day forecast, to, today will be sunny, mild, and not too breezy, so overall perfect, picture-perfect weather here for your Saturday afternoon. Rain moves into the forecast for Sunday, even some rumbles of thunder starting tonight. The rain will persist throughout the day on Monday, start to taper off on Tuesday. We'll see sunny skies rebounding. Thanksgiving looks good. Overnight lows, morning temperatures in the 40s, afternoon temperatures in the 60s, and then here comes that Arctic front on Friday, setting up for a very interesting weekend that could even bring a chance of snow for some parts of the state. So I'd say that seven day plus four more has almost everything on there. Sunny skies, severe weather chances, and snow chances. So yeah, there's Oklahoma weather right there. I'm always looking for that Black Friday weather because I don't go shopping, but I mm -hmm. like to go hiking that day. And so I'm hoping it doesn't get too cold. We'll see what happens because this time of year, it's not necessarily the cold, the temperatures that get you. It's always yep. the wind. Exactly. So we'll be watching cut, that. Exactly. can cut right to you. Thanks, yes. Damien.